burly so. Hello everybody and welcome back to Burly So. I'm your host Purified and today I am very excited to introduce to you a new piece of embroidery software. Let's open it up with a little epic beginning. Roll the music. here for the epic music as you can see ladies and gentlemen it's hatch by Wilcom. this is the answer this is the software that we've been looking for we've looked at other software over the years and let me tell you hatch makes embroidery digitizing a much much easier task and i think you're gonna love it so let's go take a look at what the software can do for us Thanks for tuning in, everybody. So we've got Hatch by Wilcom. Wilcom makes embroidery industry standard software, and they've brought an addition of their software to the hobbyist, and that's what we're going to take a look at. Um, it comes in different levels, so depending upon how many features and how many things you want to do, um, you can spend a little bit of money or you can spend... A little bit more money and get some pretty incredible software so what we're gonna do today is we're just gonna go through the different features and basically give a 50,000 foot view of the software I'll do subsequent videos that will highlight each compartment each toolbox in great detail will complete tasks and projects but for this video right here I just want everybody to have a, an idea of what this incredible software can do for them So continuing on with our tour, um, the first thing that we're going to take a look at, and I'm just going to highlight the different toolboxes. Uh, the first one is going to be the Manage Toolbox. Now this is the core, basically, of the software. Um, if you were to get the Basic Edition, this is one of the, one of the toolboxes that will be available to you. And it's, it's pretty cool. You, can, you get beautiful thumbnails of your whole embroidery library. You can preview designs. You can really organize and manage um, and, and make it simple to find all your designs in one easy location. And you can see right there um, all the different features that are available under that toolbox. And then there's your file tree and you can access your computer as well. So you can, if it's not in your library, you can add it to your library and keep building that as you go. Uh, one of my favorite parts of this is that you can export into different file formats. So if you have friends that have different machines or you're sharing with people in a club or maybe you want to try to sell a design in different formats, um, you can go ahead and export. The next area that we're going to look at is the customized design toolbox and that also comes with the basic and with this one you're able to uh, do some optimization and some customization on your designs you can uh, get all of your design information in one easy spot uh, you can change the background and the display colors uh, auto selecting fabric which will help adjust your density. That's a great feature to get nice clean designs and many other features. The lettering and monogramming tab or toolbox, I should say. And with that, that's where the, the software really starts to shine. In my opinion, I get a lot of messages from people, complaints about fonts and how do you get fonts and how do you get multiple sentences. 
this is the answer for that, people. So if you're looking for a way to get text into your embroidery designs that is seamless and easy and beautiful and perfect, this is the way to do it. Now you'll be able to take a design that maybe you want to incorporate a name or a saying and you'll be able to manipulate that text in any way imaginable. Uh, you can obviously see that there's tons of different fonts. Um, you can use true type fonts. There's machine fonts that, that come with the software. There's other fonts that are available uh, through Wilcom. And you know they'll be high quality, professional quality fonts. And then there's all the tools for manipulating how the font looks. I mean, seriously, one of the biggest struggles that I've had with some of my projects is getting a good, clean font. And this right here is for sure the answer to that. Uh, it's quality. I, like I said, you know, it's not the cheapest software. Uh, we've tried the free Sophie So. There's nothing against Sophie So. I mean, it's free, but it's a lot of work. And there's not great font support for that. I don't think there was any, actually, for that matter. And we've tried some other solutions um, that have a little better font work. But this, by far, is the best that I've encountered. And uh, you've got your monogramming features as well. You, I mean, you've got tons of monograms to choose from, different frames, nice crisp designs. I'm pretty excited about this part of the, the software, especially. And it, it only gets better from here. So let's move on to the next area. Now we make it to the artwork toolbox. And this is where you start working with the actual digitization of images. The, and it'll come with both levels, the auto digitizer and the full blown digitizer. And this is where the software really starts to shine um, with the artwork toolbox. It'll allow you to simplify the colors in your design. Uh, and I think that's pretty huge because you don't want, you know, a lot of images that you might have are going to have multiple colors, maybe two, three hundred sometimes. And you don't want to try to stitch that out. So another nice feature is that you can work on your embroidery design or your image design externally through external editors. So if you want to use MS Paint or Corel has two different drawing programs that integrate right into Hatch, you can do that seamlessly, make your changes to your image, clean it up, and go ahead and design away. So next section we're going to move on to is my, you know, my personal favorite. It's the auto digitizer. This is where, for me, this is the magic. Um, it's such an easy process. It's a pleasure to work with. I can't even tell you the amount of time and frustration that the auto digitizer has saved in just the short period of time that I've been using it. And I'm not even um, a pro at this software yet. But basically, you take a design in, you reduce the colors, you might omit a color if you want to omit a color, maybe a background color like white or something like that. And you can optimize whether it's a detail or a fill. And it's as easy as that. And then you can export your design into any format that you need. So I highly recommend any anybody out there that's serious about uh, do an embroidery design, digitizing that they want to go at least this far with the software. Now, the software will take it a step further yet, and I'll show you that in just a little bit. I can't, I can't stress enough um, how excellent the auto digitizer is. So the next part is the edit objects area, and you can control the properties here. You can copy properties, uh, you can resequence, adjust the stitching, you can do reshaping, and this comes with the, the digitizing packages as well. You can see there's plenty of different features. Um, we'll open one up and I'll just kind of give you an example. 
you know so if I wanted to select and reshape just a certain area um, just by clicking on it it gives you all the points and you can tweak your design and make it look basically any way that you wanted to if you've got a, a fill area that might not be quite reaching a border um, or an outline stitch you can do that you can resequence your your jumps manually uh, it's just it's really it's unbelievable and in the future videos we'll take you slowly through each of these areas some of these areas might even require two videos um, you know three I don't I don't even know but I'm sure I'll be doing quite a few videos on the software um, over the next you know several months year uh, two years who knows um, but next is digitize and this is the big daddy this is professional level digitizing Wilcom as I said they they're the industry standard they make e3 software which is what the pros use um, so they know what they're doing and they took all those features that were available in their other softwares and, br and, and brought versions of them to this software so that us hobbyists and even I would go small business owners um, this is definitely something that you'll, you'll want to have but you can see you can make custom shapes uh, you can do freehand drawing if you have a, a, a drawing tablet hooked up to your PC you can use that as an input device uh, it's just this right here there's a lot to the digitize it's it's quite a bit for maybe the beginner so you might want to start off with the auto but if you ever want to do some serious embroidery design that's where you have to go all right with just a few more toolboxes to go through the next one is layout editor and you can do some neat customizations with the layout editor I especially like the uh, the mirroring the mirroring or the and the duplicating um, if you've got a design that you want to duplicate you can simply duplicate and offset so you can easily grab it and reposition it and then if you wanted to you could mirror those images and it's very easy to align as you can see um, another nice part of this is it controls buttonholes in this area so if you wanted to add a buttonhole to something it'll help you work that in but this is a key essential area to laying out your embroidery design uh, the next feature is multi hooping and this is something that I have not played around with a lot there's machines out there that make multi hooping easy uh, the, the brothers that I have uh, I think it's a little bit more of a daunting task to have to multi hoop but let's say for example you have a large Sun design like this one right here and you want it much bigger than your embroidery area with the multi hooping toolbox it's easy to set your different hooping positions and it'll show you right on the design by turning the areas green which ones are going to be covered by the hoop so you can go through here and exactly plot out uh, your different hooping and this comes in real handy I, I've been to embroidery stores in the area that have like the nice Berninas and the Fofs and and all those different machines um, the Husqvarna's they, they, they have a lot better setup for that than just a inexpensive brother sewing machine or brother embroidery machine but the design output is the last full-blown feature on this toolbox and if you need to export your design into a different file format if you want to print your design if you want to set you can see right here the auto start and auto stopping where your needle position is from starting position to ending position you can do that um, but that pretty much wraps it up and if if you don't have one of those areas what what more to do is the bottom one you can purchase fonts there or I'm sure it'll take you to other levels that you probably have not unlocked I'm really excited about this the software I hope you guys are too I hope you enjoyed what you saw 
Uh, I want you to stay tuned for more videos coming up in the next few weeks. There's going to be a video every couple of weeks coming out about Hatch Embroidery Software. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching Burley So.